What's going on, Giants fans? Back at it with another New York Giants video. And in this video, I want to talk about the latest free agent acquisition for Big Blue. It is former Philadelphia Eagles tight end Jack Stahl joining the Giants on a one-year deal. And before I get into Jack Stahl and what he brings to the table, folks, if you're new to the channel, make sure to check us out on all of our social media platforms. Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube at Big Blue Avenue is where to find us. Appreciate all you lovely people that always check out our videos and make sure to leave comments below and smash the like button if you enjoy our content. So let's get into this acquisition. So Jack Stoll, one-year deal. We know the story behind Darren Waller, right? Rumors of potentially retiring this offseason, you know, then he's not, you know, he's thinking about it. Well, Darren Waller has two years left on his deal. Um, so we'll see what happens with him. But behind him, you really just have Daniel Bellinger, right? Who just finished his second NFL season. That's not enough. Um, Stahl brings a really good run blocking background, which I'm excited about. 20 career catches. So he's not a guy that's going to make many catches at all, but he has 26 career starts in 50 games. So that is something worth noting. He's 26 years old. He's 6'4, 247. So a great build. And Stoll was sort of an under, underdog with Philadelphia. He was an undrafted free agent out of Nebraska in 2021. He, he spent three years in Philadelphia, and this offseason, he was a restricted free agent. Howie Roseman and the Eagles elected not to tender him for the Giants' sign. And I'll be honest, here's my initial thought on this. Tommy Sweeney was supposed to have this role last year. Unfortunately, you know, he had that you know, little mini medical episode on the field during a practice, um, but I think Jack Stoll is going to provide for the Giants what Tommy Sweeney was going to be, what Chris Myrick was in 2022. That's the role that I expect Jack Stoll to fill. He played 17 games this past season, 38% of the offensive snaps, so not a whole lot. That's one every three plays or so, but he plays around 45 to 50% of special team snaps. We know the trend this free agency. The Giants have retained a lot of their own special teams players, right? We saw Carter Coughlin get brought back. The long snapper, Casey Kreider, Gunnar Olcheski, Nick McLeod. Jack Stoll brings a good plethora of special teams experience. And I'm very excited for him. Again, a guy who had just five catches this past season. His career high in catches in a single season was 2022. He played 17 games, had 11 total receptions, and he's only missed one career game. He played 16 games in 2021. So the theme of this free agency period for the Giants is that Joe Shane is signing durable players with a minimal injury history. Stoll has also played in five career postseason games, including the Super Bowl against the Kansas City Chiefs last year. So Jack Stoll joins a tight end roster. That includes Darren Waller and Daniel, Bell Daniel Bellinger. Very excited to see what he brings to the table. We know the Giants met with Chris Manhurts as well yesterday. They elect to go with Jack Stahl instead. So welcome to Big Blue Jack and looking forward to uh, seeing you out there this season. Now, folks, if you like what you watch one more time, make sure to smash that like button. Give us a thumbs up. Appreciate all of you. As always, comment your thoughts on what Jack Stahl brings to the table. Definitely watched him as the Eagles played against the Giants multiple times. Um, the past few seasons, as they do every year. So definitely saw him moving our linebackers back to that second level. So definitely comment on what you think of this addition. This is one of those under-the-radar additions that I think will be very, very good for this team. Folks, without further ado, let's go Big Blue. <laughs> 